फजले उमर तेरे औसाफे करे माना Under divine inspiration, the promised Messiah, Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmad alayhi salam, travelled to Hoshiapur on January 22nd, 1886, to perform Chilla. He stayed in a house for 40 days. All his time was spent in intense meditation, devotion, and prayer. These supplications resulted in God Almighty giving him the news of a grand prophecy that is referred to in the Jamaat as. prophecy of muslim maud according to this prophecy allah the exalted will bestow him a son in the next 9 years who would bring awesome progress to islam and ahmadiyat this promised reformer would spread the message of islam to the furthest corners of the earth the promised messiah alayhi salam says the first prophecy which god the merciful and noble the magnificent and high who has power to do all that he wills glory be to him and exalted be his name addressed me in a revelation and said i confer upon you a sign of my mercy according to what you begged of me so i have heard your entreaties and have honored your prayers with my acceptance through my mercy and made your journey that is the journey to hoshiapur and ludhiana a source of blessings for you therefore a sign of power mercy nearness is bestowed on you a sign of grace and beneficence is awarded to you and you are granted the key of success and victory peace on you o victorious one thus did god speak so that those who desire life may be rescued from the grip of death and those who are buried in the graves may come out from them and so that the superiority of islam and the dignity of god's word may become manifest unto the people and so that truth may arrive with all its blessings and falsehood may flee with all its ills and so that people may understand that i am the lord of power I do whatever I will and so that they may believe that I am with you and so that those who do not believe in God and deny and reject his religion and his book and his holy messenger Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam the chosen one may be confronted with a clear sign and the way of the guilty ones may become manifest rejoice therefore that a handsome and pure boy will be bestowed on you you will receive an unblemished youth who will be of your seed and will be of your progeny a handsome and pure boy is coming as your guest his name is emmanuel and also bashir he has been invested with the spirit of holiness and he is free from all impurity he is the light of allah blessed is he who comes from heaven he will be accompanied by grace which shall arrive with him he will be characterized with grandeur greatness and wealth he will come into the world and will heal many of their disorders through his messianic qualities and through the blessings of the spirit of holiness he is the word of allah for allah's mercy and honor have equipped him with the word of majesty he will be extremely intelligent and perceptive and will be meek of heart and will be filled with secular and spiritual knowledge he will convert 3 into 4 it is monday a blessed monday sun delight of the heart high ranking noble a manifestation of the first and the last a manifestation of the true and the high as if allah has descended from the heaven his advent will be greatly blessed and will be a source of manifestation of divine majesty behold a light comes anointed 
by God with the perfume of his pleasure. We shall pour our spirit into him and he will be sheltered under the shadow of God. He will grow rapidly in stature and will be the means of procuring the release of those held in bondage. His fame will spread to the ends of the earth and people will be blessed through him. He will then be raised to his spiritual station in heaven. This is a matter decreed.